Hey Aubrey, remember last week when I said the place was haunted and the chair fell? Well, it happened again during the day and a customer told us about it. Watch this chair right there. Just moves a little bit. See there? Now watch the family. And she even gets up and looks at it. Watch. gathered in Berlin to denounce anti-virus restrictions imposed by the government. With few masks in sight, a dense crowd of around 15,000 people marched to the Brandenburg Gate. Many attending say the government is violating their rights. Unsere Forderung, unsere Forderung ist zur zu Demokratie, weg mit den Dubbed a day of freedom, thousands gathered in Berlin to denounce anti-virus restrictions imposed by the government. With few masks in sight, a dense crowd of around 15,000 people marched to the Brandenburg Gate. Many attending say the government is violating their rights. Unsere Forderung, unsere Forderung ist zurück zur Demokratie, weg mit den Gesetzen, die uns einnehmen, weg mit der Maske, die uns zu Sklaven macht. In addition to ordinary people upset over what they see as government overreach, the crowd contained a mix from the far right, as well as conspiracy theorists who believe the coronavirus pandemic is a hoax. Next, new evacuations in Southern California tonight as a wildfire burns across some 2,000 acres. The so-called Apple Fire breaking out yesterday afternoon, exploding overnight, and tonight hundreds of people have been forced from their homes. Tonight, hundreds of firefighters battling a massive inferno that exploded in size. In just hours, what started as multiple small brush fires is now out of control, covering nearly 2,000 acres and growing. Helicopters and ground crews futilely trying to put out the Apple Fire as it tears through Cherry Valley, east of Los Angeles. So far, 0% contained. Es 
explicarlo. Es una luz muy, muy rara, como algo vertical, color sol, color rojo y chillanero. <risa> have a mystery on their hands. Signals from outer space are being detected, but what's causing the unusual sounds and where exactly are they coming from? In a galaxy far, far away, we're talking 500 million light years away, something big is happening and scientists on Earth can detect it. Oh, you sort of think about ET and stuff like that. <laughs> I can't think of a mystery uh, that we've had this enticing in a long time. Tim Paglione, a professor of physics and astronomy at CUNY York College, confirms a recent journal article that hones in on fast radio bursts, or RFBs, is causing a lot of buzz. What we see observationally is there is a bright, uh, very short burst, like milliseconds burst, of radio emission from someplace, from something. Paglione pinpoints their origin, in this case. It's in this spiral arm, and that's the, the localized spot of the FRB. What's most exciting about this signal from outer space is that it repeats itself every 16 days. They used to be a one-off. There'd just be this burst and then you'd never see it again. And so that made it even more mysterious. Scientists wondered if what they witnessed was even real, but picking up on the pattern changes that. They were real. We could determine uh, a lot better where they were. And help eliminate ideas about their origin. There's alien spacecraft out there and they kick on the afterburners. Is that what we're seeing? Paglione says the most likely culprit, a magnetar. It's what's left after a massive star explodes and collapses in on itself. Uh, you've gone from something about 10 times bigger than the sun, which is already 100 times bigger than the Earth, and compressed it down to the size of Queens. And it could be the reason for those repeated radio signals from outer space. I mean, invaded. I don't understand it. It's the wildest thing I've ever seen. That is strange. That is so strange. No strings or anything. It's just floating. I don't know what the hell. It's a perfect circle. ¿Sabes qué se ve, Beto? Como la figura de una persona corriendo en el cerro a una velocidad impresionante. Blanco, mono blanco.
Ya se despegó, ya despegó, sí, lo estoy grabando, lo estoy grabando.